Shalom, shalom. So last time we were talking about this ongoing feud between George Rodin and David Koresh over who would be the next prophet of the Branch Davidians. So things got a little bit wild and there was grave robbing, gun shootouts, attempted murder trials, all of this going on. And in the middle of it, one of the Branch Davidians, a man named Wayman Dale Adair, decides to say, hey guys, I think God wants me to be the prophet of the Branch Davidian Seventh Day Adventist Church. Wayman, why why would you why would you do this? Why would you do this? Upon hearing this, George Roden takes an axe and hits Wayman in the head with it and kills him. When he was later arrested, he told the police that he killed the man in self defense because he believed that David had sent Wayman to kill him. When George went on trial for the murder of Wayman, he was found guilty, but also insane, and was sentenced to a psychiatric hospital. At the time of his sentencing, George Roden owed thousands of dollars in back taxes on the Mount Carmel Branch Davidian property. David and his followers were able to pay off those back taxes and reclaim control of Mount Carmel. Now this royally pissed George off, and even though he was imprisoned in the mental facility, he continued to file legal paperwork against them, but was unable to stop this from happening. When David and his followers were able to get back onto the Mount Carmel property, they found that there were people there that George had been renting to who put a meth lab on the property. David immediately called the local authorities to come and have the meth lab removed. 